I was recently scrolling through Lightroom and I noticed that I hit over 100,000 photos. And the thing is, most of these photos don't ever see the light of day. They just live on my hard drive and they just kind of collect digital dust. And if that's the case, I started thinking about why is it that I put all this effort to amass all these photos that no one is ever gonna see except for me. And the reason is because photography really helps me personally on so many levels. The first and most obvious reason is that it helps me recall events in my life that I otherwise would have forgotten. I get a great deal of pleasure out of looking at old photos and remembering moments that I definitely forgot at the time. The brain only has a finite amount of memories that it can hold at any given point. And then if it wants to remember a new memory, it has to lose an old one. But the old memories don't disappear, they just go into a further back part of your brain. Each one of these photos that I take is essentially a spark. If you show yourself a photo of something, you're much more likely to remember it and bring that memory back to life. Each click of the shutter is also a beat of my heartbeat. And what are we really except a number of set heartbeats that are gonna expire one day? And when you capture that photo, click heartbeat, click heartbeat, click heartbeat, it's a reminder to just live in the moment, to appreciate the now and not overthink things because life in general is gonna pass by faster than you ever will think. When you adopt a daily habit of photography, it'll also help you to just notice things that you otherwise would have missed. We spend so much of our life rushing, going from job to job, from location to location. Everything is happening so fast and we're always so anxious to get to the next thing. We rarely do we just take the time to appreciate and just notice and live in the experience that we have right now. With photography, you can take your time photographing an object from multiple angles, multiple sides, and multiple lighting conditions and appreciate things in a way that you otherwise could have never appreciated them. For example, you don't realize how small and cute your kids were in the moment, but you do when they've grown up and you go back and look at old pictures and photos. You look at them in a completely different way. It's as if that kid that you grew up with when they were smaller, you just don't even recall how they look like because they've changed so much. And photography really helps you appreciate the different phases that life has, the different tones and different ways that life kind of moves and shapes objects and people around you. Lao Tzu said, nature does not hurry, yet everything is accomplished. Documenting my life with the camera every single day also really changes your perspective on time. When I look back at my photos 10 years ago, I'm like, man, I was a completely different person back then. Different priorities, different friends. And when I look at how I've changed from 10 years ago to now, you can really change a lot in a very little amount of time. Assuming that I live the average age of any adult, I basically have a lot of life left. And that kind of just opens the doors to possibility. Possibility of changing careers, of moving, changing locations. All these things are kind of within grasp. By looking at older pictures of yourself, you can see how much you've changed and realize that, hey, like a lot is possible in a little bit of time, right? So all I have to do is just start whatever I wanna to change to, and eventually I know that I will get there. If I look back at the 100,000 photos that I took in Lightroom right now, I can guarantee you that less than 1% of them are me at work or doing something that I didn't want to do, right? You only choose to document things that really matter to you. Photographing daily will help you cultivate and appreciate the people, the experiences, and the places that really matter the most to you. It just makes me look back at my life and be like, man, how much of my life am I actually just wasting away? Am I actually doing things that I don't want to document? that I legit just don't enjoy, right? That's why I really recommend that you document your life with photography every day. You don't have to be an amazing photographer. You don't have to have the intention of posting anything on social media. Photography for me is not about gear. It's not about social media. It's not about likes or followers. I noticed that a few of my videos that did really well recently had to do with the X100V, which is my camera of choice for documenting my life. However, I don't want this to become just a gear channel because I don't obsess over gear. I don't think it really matters. I think I can get the same result with my phone that I do with my X100V. I want to be more about the philosophy, the intent, the psychology behind photography. I feel like that's really why I'm drawn into this 
format for photography and I want to share that with you all. And until next time, I will see you in the next one. Peace. Dude, that was an awkward exit, but I'm not going to re-record it, sorry. <laughs>